Wherever he goes, well-placed sprays of urine announce his presence. Star's calling card has the strong smell of buttered popcorn. The fort is Sundari's one home. Only guys get overlapping territories. But Sundari isn't one to play by the rules. away from the home she fought so hard to win. And enters the rocky hills beyond the fort. This is a huge risk. She's in another tiger's territory. And it's not just any tiger. This is the home of the spectacular Zalim. A quarter ton specimen of masculinity. Sindari's here to do everything she can to get pregnant. Zalim knows she's fertile and ready to rendezvous by her scent and war. It's good information for him to have. Breeding is too much effort to attempt with an unreceptive female. Mating tigers have one goal, to produce heirs to carry on their bloodline. So there's not much in the way of courtship here. Normally, pairs mate 50 or more times over several days. Each round lasting only 10 to 20 seconds. Sundari's betrayal of Star could be her downfall. Or bring her the cubs she so desperately wants. Star, the Rantham Boar stud, cools off by the lake at the fort. It's sweet relief from the heat, now a mere 100 degrees. The lake's lovely, but the real attraction here is Sundari. She's home after her dalliance with Zalim. Poor Star. His once loyal mate has betrayed him. goes back to business as usual. The two cats have been partners for two years, but have never produced cubs. And Sindari is ready for cubs. She heads straight for Zalim, making that dangerous journey through the park.
This infidelity could get her into big trouble with Star. Sundar is not the only one with something to hide. Her new mate's hiding something too. Zamim is a single dad. It's extraordinary to see a male caring for his cubs. Males don't normally have anything to do with raising offspring. So why Zaleem stepped up is a mystery. 